Welcome back to our program. I'm your host, Ray Guo. In this segment, we will continue our conversation with Professor Li Ming from the Department of Diplomacy at the National Zhengzhi University. Professor Li, we're going to start off by talking about the South Korean mm -hmm. politics. Mm -hmm. A few months ago, um, people mourned the loss, the suicide mm -hmm. of former South Korean President mm -hmm. Noh Moo Hyun. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is somewhat of a you know, huge surprise, mm -hmm. especially for those of us you know, uh, neighboring countries mm -hmm. around South Korea. Mm -hmm. And uh, we also know that in the recent past, mm -hmm. a number of uh, former presidents mm -hmm. from South Korea, after they leave office, mm -hmm. they've almost invariably, mm -hmm. either themselves or their families, you know, get involved or get implicated mm -hmm. in legal problems. Mm -hmm. you know, why is it? You know, is it something related to Korean, South Korean politics mm -hmm. in terms of the culture, mm -hmm. in terms of what you know, people mm -hmm. uh, regard the politicians? Mm -hmm. Or is it because that you know, there is that a, a continuation mm -hmm. of democratization mm -hmm. in South Korea, mm -hmm. that they really try to clean up mm -hmm. their government mm -hmm. and curb you know, corruption? Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I feel very much uh, sympathetic and, uh, and yes. also very sorry about uh, Mr. Long Mu Hyun's uh, mm -hmm. committing suicide. Yes. And uh, I think uh, he, when he took uh, uh, the power into mm -hmm. the Chengwa uh, Te, the yes. uh, presidential hall yes. of the South Korea, mm -hmm. he uh, you know, mentioned a lot of times that uh, he would be a good president, yes. uh, a, a president of a clean politics and also uh, put very emphasis on the uh, people's civil rights. Mm -hmm. And he was a lawyer, yes. uh, mm -hmm. particularly focused on the uh, protection of uh, civil rights. So he, he was uh, very well known before he became the South Korean president. Yes. But uh, as you mentioned earlier very uh, correctly, you know, uh, many Korean uh, presidents, uh, Former presidents were, yes. were uh, either sent into prisons yeah. or uh, uh, strongly suspicion by its own people mm -hmm. after they uh, Leave went, office, went yeah. out of their mm -hmm. uh, office. Mm -hmm. That's because, uh, you know, uh, in, in, uh, in the year uh, 1987, mm -hmm. it's a uh, uh, very, very uh, uh, kind of distinguished uh, uh, kind of cornerstone of mm -hmm. uh, Korean, uh, uh, you know, political democratization. Yes. Uh, before that, we called it uh, as a uh, authoritarian regime, yes. and Military, after that, yes. mm -hmm. that means uh, after the uh, 87, uh, 87 mm -hmm. so ever since uh, uh, well, President No Tae no uh, government, yes. uh, you know, actually South Korea has been uh, regarded as a totally democratic country in the mm -hmm. world, mm -hmm. and uh, there's nothing uh, very different. Uh, if compared with the uh, Western style of uh, democracy. Yes. But this will have a very strong uh, relevance uh, with the Korean politics, domestic politics, because uh, when a politician uh, uh, will be uh, uh, elected, he probably ha has to uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, collect money. Yes, and uh, you know that uh, running for uh, civil services or running for the public uh, offices, yeah, kind mm -hmm. of a public offices, mm -hmm. uh, well, such as uh, parliamentary members yes. or even the president, yeah. uh, you know, that guy, no matter is a lady or, or a gentleman, mm -hmm. uh, would probably have to collect a, a lot of money. Yes. It's very uh, campaign uh, contribution. Yeah, 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 it's very expensive. Yes. So that uh, he or she will probably have to collect not only money but also people mm. or, and his followers. Yes. Then a kind of uh, nepotism. Well, or, naturally developed. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, naturally developed. And also a sense of clan mm. uh, will also develop. That uh, means that uh, they will have a very convenient channel for uh, fundraising. Yes. But uh, when, when those big amount of money uh, will will be pouring into a certain people's uh, pockets. Mm -hmm. well, that that will be a kind of, a, well, what we mentioned, a, a fatal attraction, quote unquote. Mm -hmm. Yes. That will be very, very uh, kind of a, a big 
attraction to the uh, politician. Of course. That will be a starting point of the, their corruption or their scandal. Mm -hmm. So there are a lot of scandals and corruptions in in the uh, Korean politics. Yes. But uh, when when the presidents should be in their offices, they will not be accused by the Constitution, mm -hmm. according to the Constitution. Yeah, they're protected. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, they Immune. will be protected by the yeah. Constitution mm -hmm. when they are in the office. But after they uh, are, are left the office, mm -hmm. they will be sued yeah. you know, by the Prosecuted, Constitution. Yes. So uh, mm -hmm. this is a, a turn out to be a very routine kind of a phenomenon. Yeah in uh, Korean domestic yeah. all the time. Yeah, Professor Lee, we know that former President No, no Mu Hyun was under investigation, mm -hmm. but there was no evidence yet mm -hmm. linking him directly mm -hmm. to any type of inappropriate mm -hmm. activities or mm -hmm. taking mm -hmm. uh, bribery mm -hmm. or you know being corrupt. Mm -hmm. But his wife, of course, mm -hmm. was under more suspicion mm -hmm. as she was you know, taken into custody mm -hmm. and questioned. Mm -hmm. uh, but the fact of the matter remains is that you know, a lot of Korean peoples mm. you know, were shocked mm -hmm. and also saddened by the fact mm -hmm. that the former president, No, mm -hmm. still went ahead and took his own life. Mm -hmm. Was it because the case that he felt honor mm -hmm. was more important mm -hmm. than anything else, including his own life? What mm -hmm. do you think? You know, South Korea or uh, even the Korean Peninsula has mm -hmm. been a long time as few of, uh, you know, uh, uh, Confucius' teaching. Of course. And uh, also Confucius' uh, 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 philosophy, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. kind of legacies. Mm -hmm. So that, uh, uh, well, some people would tell you that Korean people are the uh, are people of uh, are shamefulness. Yes. They feel mm -hmm. that uh, if something wrong with their characters, that, that they, they would prefer to uh, do some kind of a very, very, with uh, very strong reactions. Mm -hmm. so, so in this uh, sense, in this case, uh, uh, although uh, uh, most uh, uh, Korean people would think that uh, 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 Hyun was besieged uh, with the uh, scandals, mm -hmm. but uh, actually those scandals uh, were not uh, directly, you yeah. know, to himself. Yes, uh, his wife and his brother. Yeah, he is uh, also former yeah, associate yeah, staff members. Yeah, were yes. were uh, are getting involved yes. into the scandals, but not him himself. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, I think uh, uh, the reason why No Mo Hyun chose uh, this kind of uh, strong reaction uh, uh, to to uh, the accuse of mm -hmm. uh, of uh, his deeds were possibly several reasons uh, yeah. that we can find. Please. One is. Uh, to to help uh, his family, uh, to to uh, save his family, including his wife and including his his brother, mm -hmm. and to uh, make some kind of very very strong uh, kind yeah. of a statement or mm -hmm. message, you know, to the government mm -hmm. that everything should be ended, uh, you know, to himself. Okay. And secondly, uh, to avoid further accuses against him himself and mm -hmm. his family, mm -hmm. so that uh, you know uh, he always said that uh, he tried to. Uh, built upon a, uh, a clean government. Yes. And uh, this is something, you know, even before his death, he also uh, uh, said uh, very, very steadfastly that yeah. uh, he was cleaning. Yeah. Yeah, he was cleaning. He was clean. Yeah. And uh, thirdly, possibly, uh, I heard uh, this kind of a speculation from some of my Korean friends. Yes. Uh, is that uh, uh, No Mo Hyun tried to use it? his uh, uh, death or yeah. very strong action yeah. to put some kind of pressure to the incumbent government. Yes. Uh, that is uh, Mr. Lee Myung Park's government. Yes. So yeah. that uh, till uh, it's on people that uh, this current government uh, really uh, put too much pressure on uh, No Mo himself okay. and went, to, went too far. Yes. This is uh, some kind of <laughs> yeah. message that Unfair, I got. Unjust. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Yes. Mm. But what do you think uh, after his you know, tragic death mm -hmm. that uh, do you think that the current president, Lee Myung Park, Mm. will implement any type of anti-corruption measures mm -hmm. to try to prevent mm -hmm. future politicians mm -hmm. from being you know, bought into mm -hmm. or being corrupted mm -hmm. by the corporate sector. What do you think? I think uh, there's a no need for uh, Mr. Lee Myung Park to uh, put uh, uh, another one okay. or another new law or no. or another no new regulations uh, uh -huh. to uh, have his uh, the government clean okay uh, because uh, in the year 2002 okay. uh, there was a uh, some kind of organization called a Korean Independent Commission against okay. corruption okay this is uh, what we call KICAC okay has been built okay. in the year 2002 
right. and uh, in addition to this, uh, very strong uh, anti-corruption law has been also passed. Okay. So good. actually, so all know, the mechanisms are already there. They, right. They have very very good mechanisms. Yes. They have very very uh, comprehensive uh, law systems. Yes. Uh, you know, the only thing is that whether or not the uh, politicians will abide Follow. by the law. Yes. Yeah. And so whether they, you can yeah, enforce the law, yeah, that's you know, right. with the you know, a lot of countries <laughs> in Asia, that's right. <laughs> maybe ourselves included, it's always the problem with enforcement, and not so much with the law itself. Yeah, yeah. as you know, the uh, government employees will yeah. follow uh, the law, yes. will abide the law, but uh, it. It is yeah. a, a very usual that the politicians themselves yes. uh, may, not follow. Know, may not follow the law. Yeah. Uh, you know, actually, they are most of the time, uh, you know, breaking the laws. Yes, that's right. Okay. Well, thank you, Professor Lee. And we're going to take another short break, and we'll be right back to the Taiwan Outlook. And we're going to talk about the improvement in cross-strait relations between China and Taiwan. What does that do to neighboring countries like South Korea and Japan? What's their general responses? to the latest development across the Taiwan Strait. We'll be back shortly.